I was trying something. I was trying something. Isn't that what we do? Adultery? We be trying different foods and shit. Why would you think this is something we try? Why would you try getting the hell out the studio? I was trying. Don't fuck your coworkers. Hey, don't fuck your coworkers. Five. Don't fuck your coworkers. Hey, don't fuck your coworkers. Nothing could have prepared me uh, to find out that the reason we have confirmation that Ned from the Try Guys cheated on his wife is because he took Alex, his employee, to a Harry Styles concert. They were photographed there by fans. And then later on in the night are those photos that you've seen circulating of him making out with someone. And we have confirmation because it's the same exact outfit. This is an urgent message to Young Gravy. There was a new hot mom on the market. She may be a little bit younger than your normal demographic, but she's not likely to be on the market for long, so work fast. This is an urgent message to Young Gravy. There was a new hot mom on the market. She Jisoo, Jisoo, hi! Jisoo, I love you! Oh, oh my god, Jisoo, we gotta go! Jisoo, hi! We were talking about this girl. I love Christmas. I love the jingle bells. I love it all. I do, however, miss feeling happy. Guys, this is. Can we get the bill, please? Oh, can we get the bill? Bluey, inside voice. Oh, can we get the bill? Can we make her underscore? You have to understand, working at BuzzFeed from 2014 to 2017 was like being a part of the Suicide Squad. The internet reacting to Ned Fulmer T like the press thought we would react to Adam Levine. Dear Professor, I cannot attend class today. There is a rumor going around that Ned from the Try Guys cheated on his wife, and I am simply distraught. Thank you for understanding me during this time. What a day to have the name Alex. Can you imagine working for the Try Guys and having to go into work today? Try Guys, try notes app apologies for committing adultery. Not very much surprised. Let's just say the group chats I'm in are on fire. As of September 2022, Ned decides to be a whore and try adultery. <laughs> you have to. So the Try Guys refollowed Quasi. I'm pretty sure that was just a mistake. However, they were at 19. They removed Ned, um, and now they're at 17, which means they removed somebody else. They removed Kaylin. As you can see here, they're not following her anymore. They haven't updated the merch shop, but I wasn't really expecting them to. I mean, it's gonna be really hard for them to redo all of these photos. Some of them will be easier than not to cut Ned out of, but others, they're gonna have to do brief photos. They will probably do the photos for the merch pretty quickly, uh, probably over the weekend or this coming week, because any photo with Ned on it, that merch is not gonna sell. So it's gonna be in their best interest to take him out. So they're probably gonna do a lot of cutting right now. If I'm not mistaken, I believe Kaylin was part of their social media team. And I know she was very close with Alex. So it's interesting that they removed her. Alex is still followed by them and has not said anything yet probably due to legal issues. She is wrapped up in this rumor that she may have had an affair with her boss and that can have some pretty big legal ramifications. America, America has a problem. Ned Fulmer is a cheater. 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 Our investigation concluded, Waverly Hills Sanatorium can now be locked away in. Put what we had aside, I'm standing at her side. You can never be satisfied, God, I hope you're satisfied. Be Put what I can't imagine having one of the most easily recognizable faces to ever burst forth from YouTube and still be that stupid. And then to take that easily recognizable face to a public venue where there are a lot of people, most of whom possess cell phones, and bring a woman with me that I am not supposed to be with? 
They are looking at that false sense of security they have with some rose-colored glasses. Millions of people follow us and watch us on the internet. Some of them have been doing it for a really long time, but there's no way any of them will be here at this exact moment to recognize us and catch us. You don't drive 80 in a 45 when you're trying to dispose of the dead body in your trunk. And I think the worst part about this is that adults are mean. And when adults are mean, their children are mean. His kids, if they're in public school, are going to be stuck in a classroom full of children who have heard all of their mommies and daddies talking about Ned and Ariel and what Ned has done. And those mean kids are never going to give his kids a break. Not to mention the fact that when his kids are older, they'll be able to pull up all of these videos, all of the tea, and they will be able to sit and read it and watch it for themselves. I can't imagine having one of I mean, come on, no t You guys know that one thing about so Ellie Hall, a senior reporter at BuzzFeed News, tweeted this out. There's still one big early BuzzFeed story scandal that hasn't come out yet. It's going to be an interesting day on Twitter when it does. I'm just going to get ahead of it, okay? I'm just going to say it, and that's it. Gabby and I never dated. We were... He's a 10, but he's already married. They reposted this shit on purpose. He's a 10. Avoid eye contact from nine to five. Don't fuck your coworkers. Hey, don't fuck your coworkers. Don't fuck your coworkers. Hey, don't fuck your coworkers. I know you're still avoid eye. Everybody knows. Everybody knows that he fucks you. Everybody knows. Everybody knows that he fucks you. One thing about me is I cried when I was. be tripping. Like I won't bet you in your shit Walk you out the ball, bitch your ass You always be tripping Boyfriends and girlfriends are gonna come and go But this is for life Cause you only need the Do go? My wife, 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 my wife,
on their listing. Notoriously, the guy's colors are going to be blue, green, purple, and pink. I believe that was Keith, Zach, Eugene, and Ned, respectively. Um, but now you can see it just has those three. They have not done this on their YouTube yet, but it's only a matter of time. But they have done it on their Instagram. They have not removed the heart yet, but we'll see. I'm sure that'll be soon. Also, look right there. They're only following 16 now. So let's look into that. Just like this commenter said, they don't follow Quasi anymore. Quasi does follow them. I don't know if this is going to go anywhere, but the Ned cheating scandal lost my faith in men, but also if they have to replace him, it should be Gabby Dunn. How do you keep your pants up when you perform? Hello, sir. Did you witness anything strange in the air? Don't learn it the hard way. I learned it the hard way. Wait, I know you're wet and he's hard, K. It ain't camp, sis. You ain't finished. Like, even if you're getting paid, you're still gonna pay. I know what you're thinking. That's exciting, right? Corporate horror by day, literal horror by night. But after it goes wrong and the vibe takes a dive, you'll avoid eye contact from nine to five. Don't fuck your coworkers. Hey, don't fuck your coworkers. Don't fuck your coworkers. Hey, don't fuck your coworkers. I know you're staring right at his girth, but trust me. Let's ride. I want two unfiltered hours of whatever this woman wants to say right now. I want two unfiltered hours. I wonder if that model that was in an affair with Adam Levine is fuming because she's not getting as much publicity as Ned right now. I wonder if that. Whenever you tell me. Hey there, pisters. Um, I have. There is not a single thing on this planet that I could ever want more than to have been a fly on the wall in the boardroom whenever they told Eugene Lee about that action gang. I would give my left labia. There is not a- Wait, wait, wait. You guys are just now realizing this? I had a bad feeling about them for so long, but I was never able to put my finger on it. Now everything totally makes sense. I- Five. Don't fuck your coworkers. Hey, don't fuck your coworkers. Five. Don't- not Papa Buzz Buzz posting this. What if Ned goes back to BuzzFeed? Not Papa Buzz. Daddy. Wow, a guy who made loving his wife part of his brand, and then the marriage really publicly fell apart. I think I've seen this film before. Wow. Is it time to pick our fit? Okay, I'm just going to say it. Um, I was not going to add anything into the TikTok void about the Ned Fulmer cheating on his wife with Alex. Allegedly. Do I still have to say allegedly? Um, <laughs> about that whole debacle. Because uh, we all live on the same internet. I have been going through all of the stages of grief, but mostly anger over and over and over uh, all day today also. 
Um, this is not me adding to the discourse. I just have to say it out loud because a lot of people have drawn a parallel between this and the John Mulaney, Olivia Munn scandal. But what I haven't heard anyone say out loud yet is, um, what is it about young mixed Asian women that makes white male celebrities who have built an entire brand off of being a nice wife guy ready to just like throw everything away? We got an anonymous anonymous Let's go. We can't. He hasn't played. One thanks for sure. This is my too good to. Now that all this has come out, I feel like I can say it and not be a jerk about it. Um, the most interesting thing about Ned has always been Ariel, which is why he made her and his family his entire personality. So happy to never see that guy ever again. Now he's a ten, but he's already married. Five. Don't fuck your coworkers. Hey, don't fuck your coworkers. I've don't fuck your coworkers. Hey, don't fuck your co He's a ten. The Time for a feeding? Say ah. ah! <laughs> I feel so conflicted because I know that the correct answer is you're right it wasn't just ned it was also alex who's a try guy producer like look at i literally don't understand how they would do this in public without thinking that people would recognize them alex is literally engaged and ned has a whole family this is just a mess you're right and dill there we go. Stop cheating, Ned. Char Ned didn't listen. And two, two velo. One thing up. If Beyonce can get cheated on, then you can get cheated on. Why? Because cheating is a reflection of the cheater's character, not yours. If beyond Be kind to your friends today. You never know which ones never fully got over their 2014 BuzzFeed phase and maybe they're having a hard time! Five. Don't fuck your co-workers. Hey, don't fuck- I'm done. Did you do it? I'm done. You got me? Oh. I'm done. Oh. Get my mouth on. Oh. Hi. Mine's done. Are you still chewing? Your mouth's still chewing. It's still chewing in your mouth. It's still chewing in your mouth. Yeah. <laughs> done. You're both- ah. You're both such ah. liars. <laughs> yes. Doing it. I'm done. You know, I was just thinking, and I'm really not trying to hate on anyone, but- Hmm. Why am I lying? <laughs> Why did I lie? The other night, I had a dream. Confession, I am way more invested in the Ned of the Try Guys cheating scandal than Adam Levine. Adam Levine would have guessed it. Would have assumed that that was going to happen. Sorry. Ned, Try Guys? Try Guys. Confession. And as for me, lately I've been focusing less on doing... I know we're all really struggling with the whole Ned cheating type thing, but I want to make it very clear. We cannot forget that we still have these people. We still have them. We still have these two, okay? And they love their wives and they love their families. Don't forget it, okay? We still have people that are awesome, okay? look up Ned Fulmer's son because I couldn't remember Wesley's name and this comes up. As for family he is currently married to Ariel Fulmer though not for much longer. So much happening right now in the world and then there's also so much happening on the internet and I just need to like quickly rattle off some of the things that I believe I'm learning. I don't know if learning is the right You know you really made me hate myself. So, yeah. If you've gone out and you'll not be pulling a chocolate tail off. I'm an Iranian woman. As a woman in this country, we had many problems since revolution. 
Every time we came to the street to protest, we came back home with more deaths. But again, we returned to the street stronger than before. We never asked for your help, American and European politicians, because you have shown in these years that you care more about our oil and gas than human rights, and how you can sell your weapons when there is no war. You are trying to put the pressure on Islamic government with sanction, while these sanctions have brought them more money and poverty for the people. 44 years ago, you brought Mullah to Iran, so that you can colonize this country more easily. And now again you are holding hands with killers and taking pictures with them exactly when my people are on the street. The brave girls of my land are standing in front of the police and they are not afraid to being killed because they don't have anything to lose. Instagram was the only way we could get our voice out to the world but it started also to remove the posts related to this topic. We don't expect any help from you. But if you are not our voice, don't stand by the killers. Remember, we are watching you.